So I'm going to have two pieces of that. We're going to have one on the inside and one on the outside. Okay. And you're going to take all your steaks and you're going to wet them and turn them down so that they're going to be turned back down. Now where can we see them? No, wait, this is just... Yeah. See? Oh, in, I see. Okay. In, in, now, and they're coming over in. the top of it? No, they're just turning down. This covers all oh, the, I this see. Covers the border. So they don't really need to turn down. They could just be cut off. Well, no, because I think it's, it'd be very weak. If you, if you put your rim and you cut all those off, there's nothing really. This, this makes the ring stronger. I see. Because they're, they're down. If you, just, if you just cut them off and put a rim around, the rim could just come off. So what is holding them? Well, Where by is the fact it? that they've been turned around and pushed down. And then, but still, what is holding? Why can't well, it come off over the tops well, of the fold? Because you see, you've you've lashed here. So you lash it. There's another row of weaving in here. So you've lashed this to the weaving. Oh, and so you wove it after they were lashed down. Well, no, I wove... Turned down. Yeah, but the, when you let turn it down, there will be another row there. I don't want to bend them. You see, it'll be like that. Okay. And then you lash it to this row. Okay. You see? Ah, uh, yes, I see. So that this can't fall off, no, too. No, that's lashed down. Okay. So you can't do it. Now, this one, I think... Did I lash every other one? I don't even remember. Sometimes you lash every other one. This one's lashed every other one. I think my other one, I, I, I bent it in and in this way. If we look at this one. Yeah, okay, sorry. At the top? Yeah, it looks like it, yes. Yeah, they came, they came, all these ones went in. You can see them going in. And I think that's all you actually have to do. Okay. You don't have to so when you turn them down, you're turning them over the, we the last re last weaver. Yeah. yeah. So, the, so okay. you're going to lash yourself to that row of weaving. Okay. And it's strong because you've turned it. You know, you've turned these you've over turned the it, top of it. You've turned that over. Okay. It's so come over the last yeah. row. There's another row okay. of weaving in here. I got it now. And so you're just going to. So, so they have to be fairly wet then, aren't they? Yes. You have to turn, make your, make sure your basket's wet. Okay. okay. Thank you, Anchor. <coughs> well, that's a good idea. I do have that. And then, Nancy, if you're, if you're getting on, you need to, um, where are they going to overlap? You need to, to smooth them off. Um, the, the two other two ends, you know, you're, you're going <laughs> to... That's a little stuff. Um, but where you join them, if these were round, you will smooth a little bit off so that that will not be fat. You'll, you'll make that, that end thin and that end thin. Oh, okay. You know, so that they're going to be nicely joined like this. Mm. Just take a little cor corner off each. Okay. So when they join, then they go around there, they won't be sticking out, be lumpy. Oh, I see. Okay. All righty then. How many what? Is that black or purple? It's purple, but it's wet. It does.